Welcome to Rods and Reloads, I am Luke, and today we're digging into the brand new reel from PC Fun, the Alijos 400 series reel. This thing might be a monster. Let's open this bad boy up and see what she's all about. All right, first things first, full transparency, I did take this box plastic off and open it up just to make sure I had the right reel, but I have not inspected the reel, so this is a first time review for myself as well. But first impressions, boxing looks amazing. It's one of those quality boxes that you can see right here when I let go of the top, that bottom drops out just like a brand new fresh cell phone if you've ever gotten one of those. It fits perfectly in there. And when you drop the box, you have your reel bag right here, the PC Fun reel bag. Next to that, we have the bait casting reel manual right here. This is gonna be the parts diagram and the breakdown of the reel right here. Underneath this foam is the reel. So let's get that off, see what she looks like. All right, let's take a look and see what we got here. God, packaging's really good on here. First thing in here, we have the little wrench here for the reel right there. And in here, encased in this foam, is the Alijos 400 series reel. Let's take it out of here. Let's check the build quality. Let's check what she's all about. First impressions, it feels high quality. And you never know what you're gonna expect when you get a reel from a company you're not super familiar with. I've never owned a PC Fun reel before. Um, this is the first one for me. But first off, first impressions are, I love the handle, I love the smoothness of this, um, and I think it looks really, really good. Let's get into some of the specifics and the specs on this reel, and uh, let's talk about what this thing's all about. All right, let's go over some of the box specs here is nine ball bearings, which I think is actually wonderful. Eight to one to one ratio on retrieval. It has a 42 inch retrieval per crank, which is pretty high in my opinion. It has a giant 35 pound drag. This thing is a monster for drag. I think it has a carbon drag system on it. Pretty awesome. Um, it also is 14.5 ounces. So kind of right on par with all the other bigger uh, baitcaster um, low pros. Uh, mono capacity, it'll hold 270 yards of 17 pound. It'll hold 165 yards of 80 pound braid, which I think is honestly perfect. So if you have a little backing, 150 yard spool of 80 pound braid, which is probably what I'll be running on this reel, I think that'll be right on the money. All right, let's get into some of the specifics on the reel itself. Right here, we have the cast control. This is, a, depending on the weight of the lure you're throwing, um, this is adjusted. Um, it also clicks, it feels super high quality. Actually, it feels really good. It does have a star drag system right here, which also feels amazing. Has the clicks, love hearing the clicks. Feels super smooth. Um, on this side we have the brake. If you're familiar with braking systems on uh, bait casters, it is right here. It is fully adjustable. And right here we have the clicker. I know a lot of people are going to be really interested in this. This is the bait clicker here. You can turn it on and off, forward and backward. And the, well, let's take it, let's like a listen on the, on the clicker and see what she sounds like. Here's nothing. Open spool. Turn on the clicker. Feels like it has pretty dang good tension on it. Rather loud, not overly loud, but I think great tension if you're gonna run live bait. Um, I think this is a great option for a clicker. I think it's really, really good. This has a giant power handle with a foam circle on the end, and this thing just feels amazing. Just feels powerful. It feels good. I should also note this reel is integrated with aluminum alloy so it's going to be super super strong great strength on the outside shell of the reel not to mention dual brass gears 
The main gears doing the work are brass in this reel, which makes me even more excited to give it a try. All right, as you can see, we have this on a Catch the Fever Hellcat. And let me tell you, she feels real nice. If you're not familiar with the Hellcat, this is a catfishing rod. If you like catfishing, Catch the Fever Hellcat rod is an amazing rod. But I feel overall, um, this reel is going to be an excellent reel for the guys that are bumping for catfish, anchored for catfish, anything with catfish, sturgeon fishermen. I think really musky fishermen are going to really, really love this reel. Any saltwater application would obviously be incredible for this reel. It's not huge. It's not small. It's got a ton of drag. In the near videos, I will be trying this reel and I will do a review after I've owned it and used it for some time to give you guys an idea if I like it, if I don't like it. But it feels amazing in the hand. Just, it feels well, feels well built, well balanced reel. I really do like it on, a, on first look here, so. All right, that was my short little review on the PC Fun Alijos 400 series reel right here. I think it's awesome. I haven't used it yet, so I can't be full judgmental if it's gonna be a great reel because I have not actually used it. But I'm gonna use it for a while and then I'm gonna do another review if this reel is worth the money. By feeling it and just having it in my hand, it feels worth the money. It feels super high quality. I'm super excited to try it, but thank you guys for tuning in this episode of Rods and Reloads. I am Luke and we will see you on the next one.